Cook Arlington Police Department, around 8.20 p.m., off-duty officers that were assigned to the stadium events out here between the Cowboys uh, and also our baseball uh, team were alerted to a fight uh, here at Lot 10 uh, on the uh, property line here. It was a fight between citizens. When officers arrived on scene, they did hear one gunshot, at least one, and they located a man in his early 40s with a gunshot wound, a very serious injury. Uh, that man has been transported to a local hospital via air ambulance uh, now due to the seriousness of his injuries. Uh, the shooting suspect that we believe was involved uh, was stopped by officers and taken into custody. He was also transported to the local hospital for some injuries not related to the fight. I believe he was trying to kind of get away um, and may have tripped over the a retaining wall here. And so at this point, not sure what led up to the altercation or the fight. Uh, that'll have to uh, unfold as investigators continue to talk to witnesses. We understand there's probably a lot of people here, so there's a lot of interviews to be done. So at this point of the, of the investigation, uh, one person that has been shot with very serious injuries, the shooter is in custody at a local hospital. Uh, another person was taken into custody for some warrants that really wasn't related to the fight, but that's all the information we have at this point. Uh, you know where you, you know if they were tailgaters or they were there? Uh, that's like, some of the witnesses were saying they had been here most of the afternoon. Uh, that uh, the investigators will piece together a timeline okay. to determine how long they were here, what they were doing here, stuff like that, and if, whether or not they knew each other. Okay. Do the officers typically have to respond to some fights on game days? Oh yeah, I mean anytime you have a big event and uh, you have some alcohol consumption, sometimes there's some fights, um, uh, but nothing like to this magnitude.